What's going on YouTube? Paul here again. And today I'm going to do a review on the Blue Dash 5.5. Basically I picked this phone up uh, the other day. It's $130 at Best Buy. This is the uh, unlocked dual SIM 4G phone here. Okay, sporting a 5 megapixel uh, camera has some decent specs, but basically I'm going to do a benchmark test on this and see uh, see what we get with scores on this phone. Okay, so as you can see here, it's Blue Dash 5.5. We're going to do the test on it. All right, so I'll do a quick benchmark test and basically check out um, the uh, specs of the phone here. Okay. Can I show you the phone also real quick? So this phone um, does have a pretty big screen. It's 5.5 5 inches of uh, screen real estate you're getting here. <clears throat> uh, so it's a pretty good size display. Okay. So at the same time this phone does have um it's unlocked GSM. It's 4G. Okay. This phone is a quad core. Okay, 1.3 gigahertz. Uh, 5.5 inch screen has expandable micro SD slot up to 32 gigabytes 5 megapixel camera 1080p video recording at 30 frames per second and it is running Android KitKat version 4.4 right now okay so if you do decide to purchase this phone this is the box that comes in right here okay blue phone there are two variants of this okay the black one and there's also the white version as well okay so this is rocking uh, 854 by 480 screen resolution um, So for its display, that's what it has there. So test is just about done. Uh, curious to see these scores um, for this $130 phone. Um, I'm also going to do a video uh, the LG L70 for Metro PCS versus the Dash 5.5 of this phone. You kind of basically see where what's uh, the scores are between the two phones. So. <clears throat> so we got 19,016 was the score there. Okay. So let's see here. So, okay. So 480 by 854, 5.3 megapixel camera. Available internal storage, 2 gigabytes. 32 bit, 4 cores, um, front facing camera is 0.3 megapixels, Android 4.4.2. So, just a little bit of information 
uh, for anybody wanting to go pick up this phone or thinking about it. So you got a little bit of inform, a little bit of extra information um, before you go and purchase this phone. So again, this is the dash 5.5. Okay. So as you can see here, uh, pretty decent phone. Pretty good size phone too, by the way. It's pretty huge. Um, so there you go, guys.